Hello everyone. Once again, this is Dare to Speak. And, um, I just wanted to make a quick um, announcement on, on this. On the last video that I did about Kobe Bryant, <clears throat> excuse me, Kobe Bryant, and how you might have might have been murdered, most likely, suspicion wise, how it ties with the Illuminati or and things like that. And what I forgot to mention too, that his daughter that they died with him at the age of thirteen, I think that also has a significant meaning to it too. Because they're supposed to be from what I understand from my own research. There's 13 families in the Illuminati. 13. Her daughter, his daughter being 13. I don't know. If, I don't know if there's any kind of connection to that. I just like something that I just that just just occurred to me just now. It's weird. I know. <clears throat> um. There's also something I want to mention real quick. Um. I, I had this book for a while. It's a very good book if you want to know about secret societies or um, Illuminati type, whatever. It's an encyclopedia of, um, the Encyclopedia of Secret Societies. And it's by um, John Michael Greer. So <clears throat> I highly recommend getting this book it's um, really informative. They, they talk about many different types of um, many, uh, many different types of groups, secret societies, um, Masonic cults, everything you want to know, uh, occultists, um, and also the uh, the real life of Jesus, the one that has been um, hidden away from us. The real Jesus, not the fake, not the fake one from um, this from the King James version of the Bible, and a bunch of other stuff too. With Moses, and for those of you who may or may not know, um, there's a lot of stuff on King Solomon too, and um, I highly, like I said, I highly, rec highly recommend getting this book. It's very interesting. And I also want to say real quickly before I close this thing up, anybody who has any kind of questions about wanting to talk about the Illuminati or anything, because I, I don't, I really don't talk about it. I'm not really into really talking about that kind of stuff. Not because I'm afraid, but you know, I don't know. <clears throat> I'm a little weary of, of talking about it, but. But I guess it depends on how deep I go into it and who I talk about and that kind of thing. So um, anybody who has questions or any kind of stories to share concerning that, even celebrity deaths, and you know, tell me what you think. I mean, I would like to know, and then maybe I, I could, I could uh, talk about it or answer some questions or whatever. If you really want me to keep talking about this, even because the... Uh, Everybody that some people that I talked to said, "Yeah, talk about aliens. Talk about the government conspiracy, man. Uh, you don't talk. You don't talk that much about that. Talk about the Illuminati, and and uh, they're all like giving me this um, encouragement. So if you guys really want me to uh, to even talk about it, because there's a lot of stuff I know about this stuff, about this kind of thing too. And." Uh, like I said, if you really want me to talk about it, I will. Um, don't forget to share. Because the more views I get, then the more I, I'm encouraged to do it. Because, like, like again, I'm a little, like, eh, a little worried of talking about the Illuminati. But I guess, it, like I said, it depends on how deep I go into it. But some people have been telling me, that, hey, talk about this. Talk about um uh, the reptilian shapeshifters, and you know, or whatever, and like, oh boy, I don't know. But um, please subscribe if you really want me to talk about more deeper stuff. 
again, I don't mind. It's just that, you know, I need to be kind of encouraged in a sense. <laughs> because it is some deep stuff. That's why it's just not something, because I don't fuck around. When it comes to this kind of thing, I don't fuck around at all. So, um, please remember to subscribe if, you know, if you want, if you really want me to talk about it and if you want to share any kind of information or, or personal stories, you know, men in black, the shadow people, more on sleep paralysis, because I got a couple of, um, a couple of videos on it already that, that I did so far. Anything on there, so just anything on, on all of that, just, um. Give me any kind of a, like, yeah, please talk about this. Please talk about that. So subscribe and, and, and please share. The more views I get, you know, the better. I'll, I'll, I'll be wanting, wanting to talk about it even more. Because this is some real serious stuff. And then with Kobe Bryant's death and, and a bunch of other people, I mean, a bunch of other people that have died in the past. And this one guy, I forgot his name. But um, he was in the Fright Night movie, the latest one with Colin Farrell. So, supposedly he died by being crushed by his own car. And he was wedged between this metal gate and the car. And what I thought was really, really weird was the gate, the metal gate was actually so severely dented. There was like so much weight and pressure, and that's that's. And I think to myself, that's crazy as hell. He was probably targeted by um, another Illuminati hit. Suspicion wise, again, this and I man, there's so much crazy stuff. I just, I really want. I think we, I think I should talk about this, but just, just tell me what you think. Drop a comment and things like that. You know the usual stuff. So, um, again, to all of you, take care.